Hey guys, how you doing? This is your boy Rich from Rich TV Live, and you too can join the club at richpicksdaily.com where you can learn how to win and trade. Hi, how are you doing today? I'm your host, Rich, and we have a Rich TV Live with our very special guest, the COO of Coin Analyst, Andrew Sazma. How are you doing today, Andrew? I am doing fantastic, Rich. Thanks for having me and, and my company on today. I'm excited to have you on the show. Very excited about the sector that you're in, and I have some questions for you. So first and foremost, this week you released news that you're expanding into the NFT space by adding NFTs into your insights platform. How do you see this fitting into your product offering? Yes, we were actually really excited to uh, um, put this press release out this week. Um, NFTs are, you know, while in 2021, they exploded onto the scene, I, you know, I, I gotta say that I think they still have a long ways to go. Um, and we are very excited to be able to use our sentiment analysis and our insights platform to be able to help uh, people research and to get a better understanding of the NFT ecosystem and as well as the NFTs that they may hold themselves personally. Um, the other point that I'd like to make about it is it really opens up what we um, are referring to as the passion economy. I can't exactly uh, um, say that we coined that phrase. Uh, it's been it's been around for a little while now, but um, it's a uh, it's a, an exciting time uh, for for individuals and and artists and others who want to uh, take control of their own destiny, if you will. I absolutely love NFTs. I love DeFi. It's one of I would say those two sectors within the cryptocurrency space are two of the hottest sectors in the world right now. That's how fast Absolutely. they are growing. So in saying that, you mentioned the passion economy. It is a term heard more and more. What is it exactly? So to, to best describe it, uh, it, it is an uh, economic system uh, for people who are following their passion. Uh, so in, in many ways, it's, it's, the, uh, it's the influencers. It's the people who... Um, now are actually jumping into the NFT space and, and the artists who before were undiscovered or, uh, you know, in some cases, obviously some very amazing artists who were already, had already blown up Banksy, for example, um, you know, have done some NFT work or, 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 or are getting into it soon. Um, but what it really does is it allows for all individuals to be able to control, like I said, their own destiny. Um, you know, a, a perfect example of that would be like a musician, which is what we referenced in our press release. Um, they've long been tied to their record label. Uh, that's pretty typical in the industry. If, if it's somebody who's, who's made it or is up and coming, oftentimes they'll sign dozens of artists just to get that one that makes it. And this way now um, with NFTs in the space, it's going to allow musicians to be able to take control. Uh, they can put out their own albums. They can put out their own individual songs, their singles. Um, and, and they can actually do it in a manner using NFTs, which puts them in total control. And we've definitely seen that start to come on the scene here in the last six months or so. And, and we we're really expecting big things in 2022 and beyond. Fantastic. Now, what sets Coin Analyst apart from other crypto platforms, research solutions in the space? So we really like to refer to ourselves as the uh, Bloomberg for crypto. Uh, but right. I'd actually even take it a step further and now say we're the Bloomberg for digital assets. Because, wow. you know, you can no longer just say that crypto uh, is, is the main uh, function of blockchain. We're, we're now seeing... DeFi explode. We're seeing NFTs on blockchain. So it creates that transparency. So, you know, that's that's first and foremost uh, what sets us apart. We're really aiming to be that Bloomberg. The second one is we've created a number of indicators. And some of those indicators 
while they uh, exist on other platforms, um, you know, we have the years of data to back it up because we've been in business since 2018. We weathered the crypto winter that uh, so many people failed to make it through. Some of our indicators, uh, Buzz, which is essentially a social media news indicator. Uh, there is a correlation between when news rises, I, I, I don't have to say it obviously, but when news rises on a particular coin, um, there's going to be a correlation in price. Positive news is gonna push it up, negative news is gonna push it down. But you can definitely see the correlation over time as it's going up um, that something is about to happen. Um, and that kind of also plays into the sentiment, which I mentioned, the, the positive or the negative. We uh, combine those together and we do have a sentiment indicator as well, which really helps give you an understanding as to whether the market is currently bearish or bullish. Uh, we have two others that I'd like to quickly mention. One we're actually really excited about and we're building it out right now is called scam detection. Uh, we, we've all been in the space for a while and we've all been scammed. Um, but the, and, and the current way we have it set up is that it actually detects sentiment and, and other values over time. And um, once it gets to a certain threshold, it actually will send out, hey, a signal saying, this might be a scam or, you know, everything is kind of pointing in that direction. So really keep an eye on it. But we're actually going to take it deeper and we're actually going to go to the blockchain level and, and be able to monitor it and monitor the contracts and everything else um, so that hopefully we can speed that process up. I know that a lot of the uh, scams happen, you know, within the first 24 hours of, of, a, of a deal or the first week or so. Those we're not going to probably be able to capture, but we're going to continue to try and uh, hone that uh, indicator in and, and over time, hopefully be able to to uh, you know, improve that signal even more. And then the last one I wanna mention is our forecast. Uh, we have a forecast indicator, which uh, uses uh, machine learning, uses uh, uh, artificial intelligence, uh, combined with all of the data that we're gathering from across just thousands of sources on the internet. And what we're able to do then is combine all of that data and create a an indicator or a forecast indicator that suggests whether the token, the coin is going to go up or down in the next 12 to 24 hours. And we've got that actually hitting at about a 55 to 70% uh, correct rate right now. So 50, 55 to 70% of the time, it is actually um, spot on whether Bitcoin or Ethereum, for example, are going to go down or up in the next 12 to 24 hours. Um, and that's really exciting, too, because, as you know, um, much like the record, the record industry, uh, you know, they'll, like I said, they'll throw, uh, you know, 10, uh, 10 contracts out there and, and one will hit. Well, traders are very similar. They'll, uh, they'll throw money at a whole bunch of different projects and, and hope that one of them hits. If they hit 40 percent, they're happy. Uh, so if we're hitting 50 to 70 percent in our uh, prediction model, in our in our uh, forecasting, I think that's uh, just a, a really positive uh, development and, and something that traders and investors alike can really use. I agree with you. We love the tools that you guys are bringing to the table. We love technology. What are the main drivers of demand for coin analysts in the future? Well, we're hoping that actually uh, it becomes the one-stop shop for crypto research. Uh, you know, we're, we've got not only do we have products, um, but we've also got uh, we've got a, a, some additional things that I'd like to touch on here in just a couple of minutes as I as I talk about the products. Um, so we're 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 developing our insights platform to be that one-stop place. Um, in addition, we're looking to grow both organically and through acquisition. So we're going to have that one-two punch because we believe we've got a whole bunch of uh, uh, products that uh, can create a well-rounded ecosphere for the user. Um, but we also know that there are other people who are smarter than us that are creating products that uh, may, may just necessarily, you know, they, they may need the platform in order to really get them out there. So... Our, our eyes and ears are always open. 
Is your company impacted by rising or falling crypto prices? That is a great question. Uh, and I know that, um, you know, in the traditional stock market, uh, those that uh, are in the crypto industry that are publicly trading oftentimes ebb and flow based on the price of Bitcoin. But we actually look at ourselves as more as a software company or a content company. So we're rather agnostic when it comes to uh, cryptocurrency as a whole. Uh, we, we should be more uh, judged on our software as opposed to the price of Bitcoin or Ethereum or, or other coins going up or down, the market as a whole going up or down. So like I said, uh, we like to consider ourselves very agnostic when it comes to the correlation there. Now, you recently announced a partnership with Yieldster. What are the implications for this partnership? And can it be scaled up or expanded to other partners as well? It absolutely can. And that is, uh, you know, an exciting opportunity for us. It's, it's the first of hopefully a, a number of partnerships where we can, uh, you know, work together and, and see growth and positive impact for both companies. Uh, one of the things with Yieldster is we actually do have a product called Copy Trading, uh, which uh, our amazing traders uh, have been doing a fantastic job uh, up rough, man, 50 plus percent uh, wow. for the year. Um, wow. but, but the remarkable thing about that is that it, we have very little drawdown. So we're never going 100% all in. In fact, we, we actually, the most we've ever gone in it, it, on one position is 12%. So um, we're, we're, we're all about making sure that we're taking care of, uh, uh, you know, uh, 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 of giving correct signals so that people are, uh, people who are using our product um, are, are safe, because um, that's very important for us. So with regards to uh, our Yieldster and copy trading product, Yieldster has vaults in place. And one of the nice things about those vaults is they also have the, uh, the licensing and everything else that's already in place so that we can look to expand beyond Germany with our product. Uh, so that is one of the big things that uh, we're looking forward to with the partnership. Additionally, uh, they are uh, you know, talking to us about providing some uh, analytical research. Um, you know, what better way to get the coin analyst name out there than to have it uh, you know, coin analyst approved. Um, by our analysts in-house. And then they're also looking at how they can implement our insights platform as well. That sounds great. I can't wait to see it all uh, unfold and evolve. You have two main sources of revenue, subscription revenue and copy trading, which you just touched on a bit. Can you talk a little bit about those two main sources of revenue? Absolutely. Um, actually, I'd actually like to you know uh, take a moment here. We put out a press release uh, late last week talking about our market newsletter, which is a monthly newsletter. So we now have uh, what we believe to be three revenue streams. Um, right. Real quick on that uh, um, market newsletter, uh, that we started in April of 2020, and it had an exclusivity for uh, you know the last uh, year and a half plus, but we've now been able to uh, move forward and open that up. So actually, as of December 1st, uh, it is now available to the public. Uh, Great. One of the really exciting things about that is we just follow a handful of coins. We include a new recommendation every month. Uh, from inception in April of 2020, it is up over 1100%. Wow. Um, and I was just running numbers this morning uh, from... January. So basically from December 31st of 2020 to October 31st, it was up and it, it was up 560%. So um, it's been doing fantastic. And we're, we're really excited to be able to get that out to, into the public for, for, for people who are just trying to learn about crypto, because we do a really fantastic job of explaining, um, you know, what it is that you're purchasing or, or, uh, you know, going into great deal in, in, into Bitcoin, for example, or in Ethereum um, with charts for the month and, and talking about 
what may have moved it up or down during the month. And we update this monthly. And like I said, we also include one new coin every month. Uh, uh, you know, I think the biggest home run we've had so far back in February, we actually uh, um, covered uh, Chili's, if you're familiar with that. Yes. Um, you know, fr from the point of uh, uh, introducing it to now, it's up over 2,000%. Well done. So it's, yeah, exciting for us. So, um, you know, so that's, I wanted to touch base on that. And then I'm going to circle back now and, and talk about our insights platform real quick. Our insights platform is our research platform, and that is our big data, artificial intelligence infused product, where we go out and we collect data from all kinds of sources throughout the internet. You've got your social media, your news sites, um, we can, we can uh, YouTube, I mean, you name it, we're pulling that data in and we're crunching it. And what we're able to then do is, is to put it into a, a nice way for the individual user to be able to research and, and to be able to understand all, the, all of that information. Uh, I like to say um, we're wading through the noise to get to that relevant information. So we've got uh, the Insights platform, but beyond that, we've got a mobile app that we're working on right now. Uh, that's gonna be a freemium version app. Uh, we're hoping to have that launched here in Q1 of 22. That um, is hopefully kind of going to be, for many, an on-ramp into the crypto space. Uh, we're going to be providing relevant information on probably the top 20 coins or so, um, so that people can you know, get their feet wet and, and start to understand uh, what cryptocurrency is all about. Um, it'll have some basic charting. It'll have news. It'll have some of our indicators as well. So. We, we, we believe that it's going to be a good on-ramp for people who are just getting into crypto and are, are wanting to learn more. And what's really neat about that is we believe that it's also going to be that on-ramp to then our insights platform, which is a full-blown research platform, uh, desktop, and uh, hopefully we'll be able to also have that uh, enhanced for like tablet use, um, I think. We'll see about the phone. That one's going to be a little bit more tricky because it's going to be so much information. Um, I don't know about you, but my tired old eyes um, sometimes struggle looking at those tiny little, uh, uh, you know, charts and things like that. But uh, we're really excited about getting our insights platform. We've got a, we've got a, we've got it right now. It's available, um, but we have uh, extensive development going underway to um, really improve the user interface. So we're calling that Insights 2.0. And finally. We have a terminal product, uh, and that is really exciting for people like myself who like to trade, um, and, and hopefully traders in general. Um, it's going to be a full-blown terminal, but it's also then going to have all of our insights directly in there. So no wow. longer do you have to keep going out from web page to web page to you know, looking at this site, to gathering information over here, to going to Etherscan to find out more about a particular uh, project, et cetera, we're, we're looking to blend it all in together. And then on top of that, we're looking to also connect it into exchanges uh, so that you would actually be able to trade within the terminal itself. Um, that's still under development. I'm expecting that to be late Q1. Um, that probably version one will be late Q1 and then we'll uh, be expanding it as we, as we go forward. Uh, Wow. The last thing I'd love to mention uh, as far as what we've got going on is we're actually also developing Coin Analyst Academy. And oh, wow. one of the things that we've heard from so many people is that, you know, we don't know where to begin. Um, and, and, and so we're actually looking to create some courses for people to, to start to understand and learn the basics. Um, but we're also going to take it all the way up to intermediate and advanced trading strategies as well. So look for that uh, in the first half of 2022. Wow. <laughs> you guys <laughs> got a lot going on. I'm excited to see this grow. And we've watched a lot of cryptocurrency stocks absolutely explode over the last couple of years, especially ones that are doing what you guys do, but it seems like you guys are doing a little bit of everything. So from that perspective, I feel like you guys are quite unique, uh, a one-stop shop, if you will. And 
in saying that, we've got a lot of investors here and traders that watch Rich TV Live from all over the world, many of which love stocks and cryptocurrencies. And you guys kind of encompass both. So what catalyst can investors look forward to over the next six months? Well, first and foremost, uh, you know, we're, we're going to continue to work on that revenue uh, generation uh, with our uh, copy trading and our newsletter. We've already got those two streams in place uh, with insights as we get that rolled out in, in the first quarter, that's going to become another revenue stream. So, uh, you know, we're looking to ramp our revenue up here in 2022. Um, you know, who doesn't want to see that as a uh, stock investor, right? Absolutely. Um, <laughs> you know, we've also got some additional products uh, yet to be launched that we're working internally on, if that wasn't already enough that I told you about. But, uh, wow. you know, we're really excited to create that entire ecosphere for people. Um, and then, you know, the last two pieces that I'd like to mention are partnerships. Uh, we feel those are integral uh, and, and we're constantly looking for potential partners um, and, on, you know, so that we can work together and, and integrate both both, uh, both products, both platforms, whatever it may be, uh, you know, some of the, some of the different uh, partnerships that we're talking to and looking for are exchanges, um, our uh, DeFi platforms, uh, you know, anybody who could potentially benefit from using our products is a potential partner for us. And at the same time, we're looking for a partner or partners that can help us enhance our product as well. And so, you know, that, that leads me to my last piece, which is we're also looking to grow through acquisition. Now, I must remind everyone that Rich TV Live is strictly for information and education purposes. Please do your due diligence, do your research before you invest in anything we talk about or discuss here on Rich TV Live. Consult a financial advisor and always remember that past performance is not always an indication of future results. Now, in saying that, I do believe this is a company that is in one of the hottest sectors in the world. I do believe because it's relatively new that it's undervalued, underappreciated, underexposed, needs a lot of eyeballs. And I believe we can help doing that. So in saying that, I want to thank the COO of Coin Analyst for joining us today, Andrew Sazma. Thank you for joining us today, Andrew. Rich, thanks so much for having me. I've uh, really enjoyed our time together today. Always a pleasure. And I'd love to invite you back in the future. If you have any big breaking news or anything you want to discuss, love to invite you back so we can have you discussing big news in front of our community. Thank you for watching, everybody. We've told you guys this before. We bring in the winners and we bring them to you first. If you're not winning, you're probably not watching. Thank you for watching, everybody. If you like the video, smash the like button, comment down below, share the video everywhere and subscribe if you're alive. This is Rich from Rich to be Live with Andrew Sazma, the COO of Coin Analyst, saying, have a nice day, everybody. C-O-Y-X is the symbol in Canada. Thank you for watching. We'll talk to you soon.